Hello, I'm Lenny McGill with Glock Store. And every once in a while, uh, an item comes by my desk that is, uh, you know, kind of, uh, well, unusual and I guess uh, almost uh, a curiosity to me. I say, well, hmm, I wonder what that's all about. I wonder if, you know, if people would like that. And this is one of those items. Um, they're actually pretty cool. Uh, they're made by a very reputable company, uh, Magpul. And uh, Magpul uh, created uh, some uh, base plates or bottoms for M16 magazines years ago. Uh, that uh, allowed you to pull the magazine out of your magazine uh, carrier and also out of the gun and just to be able to get access to the magazine to loop, loop them. And, and they've actually come up with a, um, a cool little Magpul base plate for your Glock guns. I mean, it's very cool. Check it out. I just want to make sure everybody sees them and, and gets a chance to look at them because uh, they're, they're cool. They're inexpensive. You get a three-pack for like 15 bucks. And... Um, I thought also at the same time we could also do a disassembly uh, of the magazine because a lot of people always still have questions about it. Uh, last one I did, uh, you know, I, I, I had to do it kind of below the table and people thought it was like a, a, a sleight of hand trick or something like that. Uh, I've had a lot of people comment about that. But I do want to say that uh, taking the base place off magazines, uh, the first time especially, is hard. And it gets easier as you defeat the plastic around it, but it really is hard, okay? So they don't, don't give up. Uh, you do need a strong punch. I've been a couple screwdrivers in these, uh, trying to do these, and, and this is a brand new punch set. Uh, got a whole assortment of punches here. Uh, the biggest, stoutest one is just a little too big, and this next one is probably the one I'm going to use because I can get right in there. It's just the perfect size. Okay, now, to do this, all we want to do is grab the punch with your strong hand. I'm right-handed. Okay, magazine in your other hand. I'm not going to say weak hand, uh, but your other hand. Uh, I, I, I will tell you, it's almost impossible to do them out here unless you've taken these things off a lot. I mean, I've been to some armorer's classes where there's magazines we've worked on and you could basically do them with your thumb. Uh, but when they're brand new, you need to get up on top of them a little bit. And it's, it's almost impossible, like I said, to do them straight out here. So what I do is I put them on my lap. Ah, there it goes. Okay. Now, it wasn't easy, okay? <laughs> I mean, I'm really putting a lot of weight on there. Plus, you know, it's going to tear your hand up a little bit. Uh, but once you do it, what's nice is that once the punch is in there, it won't allow you to take the magazine plate off all the way because remember, there's a spring in there that's going to fly across the room. So you stop, okay, take the punch out. And now with your thumb, you want to control this guy off a little bit, but you also want to grab the insert plate, which is inside the magazine with your thumb, okay? Just like that. And capture it because putting it back in is a pain. I'm going to grab my Magpul base plate here and just get it started. And just slide it on. Okay. And there it goes. Just like that. And it's on. Now there is a um, a hole down here that make that they give you. You can kind of get in there and true up the, um, the little detent that sticks out of that insert plate. But that's basically it. Now, is that cool or what? I mean, really, that's just a cool little thing. So, a lot of people say, "Well, what's the practicality of all that thing?" I mean, it's kind of cool, but you know, does it interfere? Well, you can actually load your magazines very well, no problem. Got to take a, a look at this real quick. And I'll get the gun up here. And putting it into the gun, no problem. It's ergonomically shaped like that. So the other thing is when you want to pull it, in case it gets stuck, you actually have something to pull. Now, one of the most practical applications I saw, though, was it allows you to hold on to the magazine, either like that or like that, and still get a full-size grip on the gun. So that is what I feel was probably the most useful. You can actually grab hold of that magazine and still get out and work the gun, but still maintain you know, this mag without having to have the mag here. The other thing it could do is if you had it in your pocket, a little easier to grab out, load, and go, versus uh, you know, just trying to fish out and trying to get your hands around the actual body of the, of the case. Uh, I thought it was a cool item, and I thought you would enjoy it too, and it's one of those things where they look pretty cool. Um, 
Will you use them? I don't know. But I tell you what, it's one of our uh, newer items, and uh, I thought you'd enjoy it. It's the Magpul faceplate.